Hi, this is Sangeeta Rajiv. Uh, I'm a singer, composer, performer, dancer, etc., etc., etc. So, uh, yeah, um, my journey started with um, me being an independent musician. I started composing my songs. I started performing, and then I landed up in the Kannada film industry. And right now, uh, I've reached a level where I'm, I'm, you know, I'm uh, producing my own Hindi album. See, my story is like I, I never knew I wanted to do do music. Uh, basically, I was a dancer. I've been trained in Bharatnatyam classical dancing for about. Uh, 15 years and um, one day i just fell off the roof from my uncle's house and that's it i don't know how i fell off uh, but i did fall i just remember myself falling down and um, i hurt my spinal cord and um, because of that accident uh, doctor told me i'm not supposed to dance so that was like uh, that's it my this is the end of my life because dancing for me was my life and uh, it was very difficult for me very very difficult for me to uh, you know even listen to that from the doctor that i had to stop dancing so uh it was it was like i was totally I was totally destroyed, and uh, my mom, again, was my support. Um, she said, "Okay, now you, you can't dance. That doesn't mean that you know this is the end of your life. Uh, you, you are going to study, and uh, you will get into a good job. But then, what I wanted to do was, I wanted to become a dancer. I wanted to perform everywhere, and." Um, that wouldn't happen so that's okay i've made it happen now uh, because i'm not a dancer anymore i'm a singer and uh, and luckily i've got this usp in me that you know when you see my performances i just don't sing i dance and i sing so itna dancing i can do but doctor is permitted and um, i've made myself strong in fact you know i've i've exercised a lot and uh, i didn't even undergo a surgery uh it, it was like three long years uh mri 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 scanning and um, doctor said okay now it's time to operate and you know fix this thing um but i i was like no i i don't want to get any operation done to me today everybody is in the corporate and you all know that uh, we do get a monthly income for whatever we do uh but here yeah it's a freelancer i was doing a freelancing job as a musician uh so initial uh two years was like very difficult for me um the first year though i i didn't know what i had to do i was totally lost and uh i didn't have money uh all the money that i earned i had to shell it out on music and uh, uh my mom used to give me money to travel in auto you know uh she used to be like don't worry i'm there for you uh, you take this money you go you go meet producers directors you go uh finish your work go to the studio work on your album so there are a lot of people who have helped me in this uh, financially also uh, so a lot of support from my uh, mother there's always a no from family when you have to take up something extremely new parents who you know give it a second thought uh, they do think okay is this the right uh, feel for my child because they feel insecure it takes a lot of time for you to understand yourself so don't just rush into anything uh, education is very very important today if i'm surviving here uh, then it's because of my experience in the corporate um, I have learned about marketing myself. Uh I have studied. Um I'm a very well educated person. I am a business woman. Uh so I understand the market. I know to talk to people and I know how to face people. So it's very important that you you know uh, build yourself as a personality first and then take up something. Actually my mom also gave it a thought not because the industry is bad 
just because she thought okay this girl is earning uh, so much in a corporate and if she's going to leave the job then she's going to land up with nothing no money uh i said i'm ready to face that and uh, instead of just letting me go away uh my mom said no i can't let you go away like that you know uh because it's very important that you have somebody who's supporting you uh both financially and mentally and i needed someone and my mom stood like a pillar and she said uh, i'm there for you go ahead and do it i very well knew that i'm not going to earn even half of what i was earning uh in my it career so it is very difficult uh, if you're ready to face that then definitely you know you have to go for what you want to do uh but you also need support and i request all the parents that you know please give chance to your kids if they're not interested in doing what they're doing and they want to do something uh creative please let them do it takes time but yeah it happens you have to stick on to it